So hey everyone, how's it all going? Hope you're all having a great day. Today we're going to talk about the possibility of Battle Royale coming to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So to be honest, for me personally, whenever I hear the words Battle Royale in the context of a game, my impressions are immediately kind of negative. You see, I agree that Battle Royale, to an extent, can be a somewhat exciting and enjoyable experience but I feel like it's becoming way too played out every game is just thinking do you know what let's scrap everything we're doing we'll just add battle royale to it candy crush no worries we'll do candy crush battle royale plants vs zombies not anymore it's plants vs zombies battle royale chess not anymore it's chess battle royale that kind of thing to be honest I was kind of surprised when they added battle royale to black ops 4 last year but we recently learned that that was actually not done deliberately that was kind of accidental they didn't mean to to originally add Battle Royale to Black Ops 4, it's just that they scrapped their campaign, they messed up with that, and they thought, we've got to add something else, what can we add? We'll add Battle Royale. But anyway, the gameplay you're probably seeing today is some Blackout, and we're going to talk about what we know about Battle Royale for Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So, not too long ago, there has been a rumour from a number of people, but I think the main person is the gaming revolution. Um, oh, there's lots I could say about that, but anyway, so this guy claims that uh, he has a source that knows about Infinity Ward, their development, and Call of Duty Modern Warfare. And he's saying that he's hearing that there is going to be a Battle Royale mode for Modern Warfare. Now, supposedly, this mode is meant to have currently around 152 players, and that the map is around three times larger than Black Ops 4 Blackout, and supposedly Infinity Ward want to up this to 200 players. Now, I'm going to be honest, if that was a thing, that would be pretty cool from the player count alone. It would be it would be enjoyable to have a large game mode where you can just mess around, tons of people, uh, massive map, tons of chaos, that kind of thing. But straight off the bat, something seems a little bit uneasy. You see, I don't see how they can add that many players and there not be problems. I mean, Black Ops 4 started with around, what, 75 players, something like that. They then upped it to 100. I know they wanted to go even higher, but the game, it works all right. Yeah, sure. But it's not the best, I have to say. You know, I think we're all a bit underwhelmed with the graphics and just the general look of the Blackout map. It was a bit underwhelming compared to that of multiplayer and other aspects of the game. Now, it has gotten better, I think, over time it has. And it's not surprising considering supposedly Treyarch only had around nine months to work on Blackout before the game came out. So, in fact, less than if you consider the fact that they had to get out a beta and a workable version of it. So I'm impressed that in the small amount of time they had, they did do quite well. But given it's Call of Duty, you want to increase the size of the map by three, because Blackout's pretty huge already. So you want to you make it three times bigger, right? Okay. And you want to add up to 200 players. So basically doubling what we've got now and what the graphics are just going to stay the same and all the character models are going to look fantastic there's going to be vehicles i just don't see it happening call of duty i mean it would be kind of cool in some senses but i just don't see it happen i really don't now this hasn't been confirmed at all and when we first got our little teaser announcement of uh, modern warfare it did just say that it's going to include campaign multiplayer and co-op mode and you may think well you know it would be something quite nice possibly for them to kind of announce that hey we've got this uh, new mode and everyone's going to enjoy it. There's a couple of thoughts here. So first of all, the thinking possibly is that this Battle Royale mode might actually be part of multiplayer rather than having its own separate mode, which I think would be kind of better if you kind of integrate it into multiplayer, having it as a as a big map, big mode, big players, that kind of thing. So that would be quite good, I think, to integrate it into multiplayer. And at the same time, I think the impression of Battle Royale has just gone downhill. I think it's just gotten worse and worse over time in the sense that so many games are doing it, churning it out, it's getting boring, it's getting repetitive, and I really don't enjoy it that much. I wouldn't really ask them to put it in the game, but if they do, you know, I'm not going to complain, but I wouldn't particularly be looking forward to it. Now, back when we first got an announcement, it specifically said that the studio actually declined to comment on whether they would be adding Battle Royale or not in the game, and then just the other day, I believe... Someone asked one of the Infinity Ward art directors uh, about the rumour whether Battle Royale would be coming to Call of Duty Modern Warfare and he replied with a gif saying no comment. So I feel like this is a deliberate thing that they've been asked to do by Activision. Now supposedly it will then create more interest, there'll be more talk about it because they're not specifically saying no, they're not saying yes and it creates more hype around the game. So that is an interesting marketing technique and 
it really wouldn't surprise me if they were doing that because that's just something that they like to do. We don't know for sure, but I'm saying at this point, I'd say it looks about 60 to 70% likely that we're going to be getting Battle Royale in some form in the game. Now, I, like I said, I don't know how to feel about this. It's not my favorite mode. It's not my least favorite mode, but I don't particularly enjoy it. And I think they should be focusing on other aspects of the game. Now, they haven't got zombies and they've, they've actually said that outright. If they said no comment about zombies, you know, you'd think they might do this similar thing about Battle Royale, but they've literally said, no, we're not having zombies. So it's very weird that they're not specifically saying no about Battle Royale. And what I'm thinking is that they want to kind of keep it secret, not say anything about it. Then once the game launches, people see, oh, Battle Royale, kind of like when Advanced Warfare came out and you had your campaign, your multiplayer, and then you had your, like, your spec ops missions, kind of, or survival, I think it was. And when you completed the final map, it was a teaser for Exo Zombies, which, in all honesty, was quite a crap mode. I really didn't enjoy it. But but anyway, they kind of kept it secret right up until the last minute. Well, until people leaked it. But I think they're trying to do the same thing here again. Now, am I particularly pleased about the prospect of Battle Royale coming to Call of Duty Modern Warfare? Not really. Uh, because, like I say, I really think they should focus on the multiplayer. The problem with Black Ops 4 is that they put a lot of emphasis, and I mean a lot of emphasis, on Battle Royale, on the Blackout mode, especially post-launch. A lot of the content and manpower is directed towards Battle Royale, and I just kind of find it quite frustrating, you know? I'm glad they tried something new. I don't think it particularly worked as well as they wanted it to. I think they just kind of leave it where it is, and if they want to keep updating Battle Royale and supporting it post-launch, they can do that still with Black Ops 4. But I don't really want them to bring it a whole nother mode over to Call of Duty. And, you know, the thinking is that, oh, well, with this new engine, we'll be able to do so much better than we can with Black Ops 4. I highly doubt that. Like, okay, I know it's a new improved engine or what have you. It looks good. It sounds good. I just don't believe that it will function anywhere near as well as we would be allowed to believe that it will. So, like I say, personally, I think they just leave it where it is and not do it. But if they're going to do it, I'm not going to complain. I'll probably try it out, but it probably won't be my focus at all. I just don't really find it that enjoyable, unfortunately. But, yeah. The other thing as well is that, supposedly along with this leak, I have heard other information about Activision wanting to emphasise a lot of their focus on this battle royale mode because it will allow them to push a lot of micro dlc microtransactions and ultimately generate more revenue which the sound of that it really puts me off because Modern Warfare saying all these things oh it's gonna be fantastic it's gonna be this it's gonna be that but when you start hearing oh well activision might be focusing on this a little bit more so we can add push more sales more micro dlc more microtransactions it just you know it's it's too good to be true when they're saying that it's going to be fantastic and all this and it really starts to make me think that they're going to do something that's going to kind of threaten how good modern warfare will actually be so i'm not very excited at the prospect of this coming but i'd like to know your thoughts if you think i'm completely wrong please let me know down below in the comment section what are your th experiences with black ops 4 battle royale i.e blackout and what are your thoughts on them coming to the new game do you like the sound of it do you not let me know down below thank you very much for watching guys feel free to check out my latest videos and if you enjoyed the video uh, i would definitely appreciate if you guys leave a thumbs up and if you haven't already consider subscribing as it really helps me out and you can see my latest videos but thank you all so much for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you all on the next one